Former House Speaker Dennis Hastert was sentenced to 15 months in jail on Wednesday for evading banking reporting rules in what prosecutors said was a bid to cover up sexual misconduct allegations. Is anybody satisfied with this process and this sentencing given the gravity of the historic crimes? Of course not. I, I wish Mr. Hastert had been called on the carpet in 1968 and we'd all be better for it. Um, this is imperfect. Um, but it's what we got. U.S. District Judge Thomas Durkin called 74-year-old Hastert a serial child molester and handed down a sentence that went beyond the range of zero to six months recommended under a plea agreement Hastert reached with federal prosecutors last year. Hastert made multiple large cash withdrawals in increments of less than $10,000 to avoid transaction reporting laws in order to pay off a former student he sexually abused decades ago. Prosecutors said Hastert agreed to pay a man, known only in court documents as Individual A, a total of $3.5 million to remain silent about the allegations. Prior to being elected to Congress in 1987 and rising to political fame, Hastert was the wrestling coach at Yorkville High School, where the man claims he was abused as a teenager. Hastert was not charged with sexual abuse because the statute of limitations had run out long ago. We brought the charges we could bring, and through that, Mr. Hastert's legend and legacy are gone, and in its place are a broken, humiliated man. That is as it should be. Hastert served in Congress for 20 years and was the Speaker of the House from 1999 to 2007, the longest serving Republican to hold the esteemed position. At his sentencing Wednesday, Hastert said, I'm sorry to those I have hurt.